Bob, there's no enjoying any of this. We're miserable, Bob. Hi, guys, and welcome to another episode of Decarnation. <laughs> uh, but we are in a weird situation where we are actually out of um, our, our uh, holding place. <laughs> our room we're out of our room um but we managed to escape somehow i think this is Lord gloria hallucinating this or having a dream about this um but if it's not then this is some wild dream we're having or if maybe the dreams aren't dreams because i'm suspecting there's some supernatural stuff happening right so maybe the dreams aren't really dreams but maybe like some um astral projection thing that's happening if it's astral projection that would be actually kind of cool but that's that's my theory on this <laughs> but if it's not then fine but i don't think gloria actually escaped but we'll see <laughs> we'll we'll see if she did um also i may change her voice just a tad bit only because it's wrecking my throat <laughs> it actually is so it's putting in it's putting a bitter strain on it so um i'm gonna try to try for a softer tone she may see she may sound the same she may not we'll see but as is it's 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 wrecking my throat <laughs> so i can't continue doing that voice i initially gave her but anyways let's go ahead and get back into the game <laughs> out for good Right. Oh yeah, we are out for good. All right, Gloria. You say this. How am I going to leave this place? Um, we we if you knew how to swim, we can just swim and get out. <laughs> I know how to swim. We could just swim and get out. Or jump across. Looks like the bridge stops here. This post looks a bit small to stand on. Lucky for me. Lucky for you, you know how to jump, don't you? Interesting. Balance is a dancer's something. Oh my god. Oh, oh let's go. Oh, esports, baby. Oh, let's go. <laughs> At least a balance is one thing nobody can never take away from me. Hello. Um, oh my god, there's more of you. Um. I could drown. That would fix everything. Right, okay. I don't think that would fix everything, but right. That's very morbid. Right. So young. So talented. Sinking to the bottom. Right, okay. Um. Right. I've never seen a statue look so embarrassed. Wait, is, is that a face on the body? Yeah, that's a face on the body. <laughs> that is so weird. Ew. Oh, oh my god, a, a bigger face. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, wait. Oh my god, is that more faces? I'm, like, noticing things. <laughs> it needs to be spotless. A clean room is a clean mind. Mm-hmm. Gloria needs to really clear her mind. Um. Ah, there you are. Gloria, we have been expecting you. How do you know my name? Just a guess. You look like a Gloria. <laughs> Weird. Wait, did you say you've been expecting me? Who are you anyway? Don't you know? How would I? I just met you. I'm calling it now. That is older Gloria. That is the future Gloria. That is the old lady Gloria. Did you? 
I don't have time for this. Oh, are you in a hurry to be somewhere? Yeah, actually, I'm trying to get home and I really don't have time to talk. Home? What a beautiful concept. Especially when the bathroom is equipped with a, a rain shower and the bed has clean silk sheets. Are you homeless? Is that how I appear to you? Oh no, I don't judge I don't judge people on their looks, but bench sitters around here are usually tourists or vagrants. You don't really seem like a tourist to me. You're right. I don't have a home. But I don't need one because I have something bigger. A penthouse? <laughs> something better. Take a deep breath and look up. Don't do it, Gloria. The sky blue smiles above the roof. It's tenderest. A green tree rears above the roof. It's, it's waving, waving crest. crest. Wow. I learned that poem in middle school. I'm amazed that you know it as well. Who could have imagined? Yeah, that's her. That's that's her old. That's her as an old lady. <laughs> that is old you, Gloria. And do you want to stay a while with me on that bench? Watching the sky and breathing? I I appreciate the invitation, but I had a, a difficult night. I'm tired, hungry, and I stink like a moldy basement. So I'm going to go home, take a shower, and sleep forever. I understand, Gloria. It's part of your journey. You can't skip any steps, even if the path is a spiral. But don't worry, Grey Braid. I'll keep breathing, I promise. Just remember, if you need any help, you know where to find me. And don't forget to make some room in your chest. Uh, I'll keep that in mind. Right. Room in my chest, you say. Interesting. What is up here? Right. Uh, why do the birds look so weird? Make some room in my chest? What the heck does that mean? Right. Do you ever look out on the horizon and wonder, would things be different if I wasn't so stubborn? Maybe that's 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 a thought I'm sure people have. Pretty deep thought, actually. Maybe if I just wait, it will open up. It's not like I'm going to be here forever. It, it, you you can stay waiting because if you don't do anything about it, it's gonna stay closed forever. You gotta do something to open it. Old me, where did you go? Okay, well she poofed. She's gone. Oh, pretty. The dancer, 1789. She looks audacious and free, even in the jaws of the beast. I've thrown a coin and made a wish. I don't think it will come true. With that attitude, it won't. You gotta believe in your wishes. Why did I say that it was a relief? Why didn't I fight back to win her back? We could have grown old together. It's those what ifs, man. I know those regrets. Can we like appreciate the art though? Like on the walls? Like there's some pretty art on the walls. <laughs> Tampons, bacons, vegetables, and a tiramisu. I should have picked up the groceries. Right. Wait, are, are, are... 
Are these our fragmented thoughts that we have? Our regrets, what ifs, and things like that? Interesting. I could have been in the St. Louis group. No one would have been able to compete with me. Right. I do appreciate how, like, the city itself is, like, a masterpiece in, in its own right. This is a lot of detail and work put in, and I appreciate all of it. <laughs> ah, Paris will always be Paris. Hello? Oh, you don't speak. Oh! Damn, can't find the latest cosmopolitan oh well is that my face on this journal interesting what is that right okay books about housemanian architecture and exist existentialist philosophy right oh oh what's down here i can go down here what's down here void le nest N never heard about this club un jour jirai a uh, tu okay toutes les nuits De Conner. <laughs> I don't know what you said. Eat your greens, mommy used to say. Man, this game is making me want to learn French. It's life. It'll pass. Yeah, this game is making me want to learn French. Because my parents speak French. They speak Creole. Because... Cause I am part Haitian, French, and Dominican, and <laughs> God, like, I don't know any Creole, French, or Spanish, but like my, I know for sure, like, that's definitely something I need to learn eventually, French and Creole, I, I, at least those two languages, <laughs> I'll eventually learn, like, I know, I, I, I know my numbers, kinda. These are urns, like, for ashes or spices. You know, un, deux, trois, quatre. You know, like I know, I I know some numbers in 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 French, but that's the thing though, because French and Creole, I don't know what's the Creole variant of numbers and what's French. So, I know how to count one to ten, but it could be the the Creole one to ten and not fully French. <laughs> Oh, oh. 68 Beaumarks, yes, Boulevard. I made it. Beaumark, Beaumarkais? Beaum I don't know how to say that. <laughs> but we made it. Are the garbage collectors on strike or something? You see, here's, here's the thing, Gloria. You are hallucinating that's 100% sure you're dreaming it's not that the garbage collectors haven't come to collect it's just you your mind is so messed up right now that all there is is just fragmented garbage keys fuck i don't have my keys he hello Who's there? Cage. Head. Uh, okay. Can you help me get in my apartment? She can. Outside voice. Can have this. What is... What is that? That's a big-ass nail! Bet I- bet I can use it on the lock. 
Thank you, basement voice. All right, thank you, basement voice. Wait, can you help too? Sure. Oh, 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 what do you need? She don't want to annoy outside voice. You're not annoying me. What can I do for you? It drip, drip, drip. On her head, exhausting. You need something to cover yourself with? Yes, outside voice is sweet. It's Gloria, and I'll see what I can do. Alright, um... Just a pile of trash. Right, okay, we, we need to find something to help with the drip, drip, drip. Drip, drip, drip. Oh, umbrella. There's nothing except for this crappy umbrella. That'll work. Anything. There you go. Here, that's all I could find. Sorry, it's not in better shape. I hope it's... She good, you nice outside voice. Do you have a name, basement voice? She. She mess in the head. The cage. Right. Okay. Um, let's just open the door, Gloria. Wait, is the bird just one giant eyeball for a head? I just realized. Oh my god, it is. Come on. Yes, got it. Home sweet home, here I come. This is not the same home, Gloria. It smells like lemon fresh detergent and old rubber. This is definitely my place. Any mail? A flyer for a Pacific cruise and a stack of fashion catalogs. Who do I have to travel with? And who do I have to dress up for? Um, Gloria, I am very sus of this. Can't wait to take a shower. Oh, interesting. You never know what people keep hidden and locked up tight beneath the surface. Sometimes it's better that way. I bet it is. All right, let's go inside. Ooh, third floor, here we go. Up, up, up we go to the third floor. Maybe a glass of wine first before rinsing off. Or after? With the pizza? I don't think there's pizza to be had, Gloria. And the doormats aren't there. Gloria? It's too late to knock. Uh, what did she say? Not normally one to eavesdrop, but... Please, darling, stop crying. Mommy can't take it anymore. Maybe, maybe I can lend a hand? Please, darling, stop crying. Uh... Well... Fuck. I guess we go back inside. Yeah, we go up. <laughs> we'll just go up. Interesting. Okay. Oh, God. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, and thank you. All right. I got something. Let's explore all the floors, shall we? about floor five. 
Let's take this one instead. Oh, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. So something to help with the baby crying. So the heart, that is a doormat, but I think the piano would work better. Yeah. All right, here you go. That's not going to calm the child. Okay, never mind. Oh! Okay, Gloria, um, um. Gloria! Gloria! Wait, 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 Gloria, 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 no! Okay, we don't go down. We do not go down. Okay, no, that's where I got the piano from. No, 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 let's, okay, how about doormat? What about doormat? Uh, the the doormat kind of helped, whatever this was. Yeah, 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 let's, let's take that instead, because apparently that, that helps. Oh, wait, 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 hear me out. Hear me out. Oh, interesting, floor two, so... Oh, a passy. Okay. All right. So I I thought going down was going to put me back to that weird scene that we drowned at. I think that was just a consequence of getting it wrong. The baby's finally quiet. Sleep tight, little love. Mommy needs her rest too. We gotta put the doormats back. Okay. <gasps> I wish I remembered. What are you? This, this is the kind of thing you can't fix with an apology. The heart. That one's the heart. Oh, this is a fun puzzle. They expected you to remember this? What? Okay. That one's the heart. Yeah. Yeah, this one's a heart. There we go. Am I a fool for trying to fix things between us? Oh, whoops, that's not her talking. <laughs> Am I a fool for trying to fix things between us? Or is he a coward for giving up? This one was music. A little art every day keeps the demons at bay. Right, okay, a little art every day. So that was not the piano. So that means that there's one on the lower here, yeah. Uh, I, where, oh, okay, there it is. Okay, that's T. That is not it. Um, <laughs> I don't think that's it. I don't want to see the image again, so I want to get it right. Because <laughs> music is considered art. I believe. Yeah, that was a heartbroken one. We already got that. Okay. So, I want to say that's the music. Music is considered art. I'm pretty sure this one's music. Oh, uh, yes! <laughs> Even the devil dances to good music. Oh, the last one, easy. Our... 
Yeah, Gloria, yeah, you are, you are hallucinating this. That was a hint. No matter how many cups I make, nobody's coming over. Don't worry, don't, you never know. I mean, at least you're making cup to drink for yourself to enjoy the tea. Duh, that's what matters. All right. Wait. No. Wasn't the first floor tea? What was the second floor? Wait, did they switch him around? Yeah, floor five. Wait, why did it? S okay. That was weird. <laughs> Oh boy, look at us. We have our regular outfit on. Yeah, we're about to wake up to a rude awakening. I can feel it, man. The kettle's whistling, but for whom? My door. It should be here. My apartment, my little nest. Please! Oh. Give me my life back! Day dot dot dot! Hello? Hello? Gloria? Hey, are you alright? I've made bulan biai blah la urchins and mussels a treat for the deep. <laughs> Gloria? Well, enjoy. Bob, there's no enjoying any of this. We're miserable, Bob. Gloria? How was the Bulon buys. Tasty, right? Oh, you haven't touched the food. I'm sorry if it's not exactly hitting the spot. Are you angry with me? Bob, we just want to get out of here. And I don't know how to pronounce that dish's name. <laughs> oh, no. Hello, Gloria. How are you doing today? I found a new recipe for Kokogvin. Care to tell what you think? Yes. I have to go pick up an antique at Duval for the master. Right. Gloria is I don't blame her. She just she she snapped. She snapped. Looks like you haven't touched your plates. You have to eat, Gloria. I'm worried. Gloria's not gonna eat shit. She wants out. I made the best recipe I know for the nicest person I know, Pigeon Vulavent. Gloria, please? Um, Gloria. Do we have to interact with it? Oh, the camera's not following us. Okay. That's cool and all. So you decided to eat after all. I guess she doesn't want to die by starvation because that would suck. You're eating. I was so worried, but I knew the 
volovent, I don't know how to say that, <laughs> would put the mine or would put the wind back in your in your sails. Yeah, whatever. Sorry, I'm bothering you. At least your appetite's returned. Why do you care? What do you mean? What the hell do you care if I sit here and starve to death? It's not like you want me here. Your master does. Right? So why do you mind? Well, I... Because the master wants you to... Wants to take care of you. And... And because I care. I just do. Is there anything else you might fancy? Nothing that you can't provide. I understand. Well then, I'll be off for now. Hmm. Bob? Actually, I wouldn't mind something a little sweet. Of course, I'll do my best. What sweets would you prefer? I don't know. Surprise me. Okay, then. I'll be right back. Right, Gloria, what are you thinking? What are you thinking, Gloria? Is she gonna kill Bob? Because I would kill Bob. <laughs> Can you smell it to Gloria? The soothing scent of fluffy pancakes, fresh from the pan. With chocolate sauce on top. Yeah, I'm kind of traumatized from, from the chocolate sauce on top that you did last time. Ooh, you know what, Loki? If Gloria gets fat, he's not going to want her. There's that. Because he wants the perfect figure, Gloria. But it, 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 if she gets big, he's not going to want her. What happened? Oh, yeah. Oof. Your apartment gone. This bottle of milk spoiled ages ago. Smells revolting. Right. Where's my stuff? This looks so, like, depressing. There's nothing I can hope for out there. The phone is ringing, though. Hello? Gloria, is that really you? Oh, God. I was so desperate. Who is this? Why, it's me, sweetheart. Mommy? Finally, after all these years. I did everything I could to get you back. After that day. What day? Stay where you are, sweetheart. Mommy's coming to get you. Don't talk to any strangers and wait for me. Mommy is coming. Okay, apparently the old ladies are mommy? Mom! <laughs> Hello, Gloria. Mr. St. Louis speaking. Hello? Oh, hello? Yes, I wanted to thank you. Thank me for what? For the show, Gloria. For the show. You know... Back then, I wasn't quite sure you'd fit in, and I could see from the start that it wasn't always easy for you. Adjusting to a new place, a new role, a new audience. But day after day, with each and every performance, 
You improved. You became more... satiating. More enjoyable. And now I can say, for what I envisioned, you just proved to be perfect. Oh my god. Who is this again? Logria? Who is this? <laughs> it's me. Me? Gorlia. Oh, okay. It's just Gloria jumbled up. <laughs> yes. Gloria? Gloria? How can you... I'm begging you to stay with me. Finally, after all these years together, mommy's coming to hug me. For the show, Gloria, for the show. Where are you calling from? From the inside. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Chill, 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 Gloria. She dreamed she was a lovely swan, so full of poise and grace. But she became an ugly duck, forgotten and disgraced. When love did not come seeking her, she searched for it instead, then squeezed it in her arms so tight she sadly crushed it dead. With vanity a guiding star and fear her chilling oar, she sailed to sea at dawn's first light and drowned beside the shore. Right, okay, um... What? Wow. <laughs> But she became an ugly duck, forgotten and disgraced. Then squeezed it in her arms so tight, she sadly crushed it dead. With vanity, a guiding star, and fear her chilling oar. Oh my god. Right, 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 right. Go, go, go. Oh jeez. She dreamed she was a lovely swan, so full of poise and grace. Oh! But she became an ugly duck. Uh-huh. Forgotten in disgrace. When love did not come seeking, she... Is it this one? Shit. No, it's not. Okay, I got it wrong! Oh my god, this is weird! <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. She became an ugly duck, forgotten in disgrace. When love did not come seeking, she searched for it instead. That's the fridge. Is it this one? That sailed the seas. Okay. Oh, this one. This one right here. There it is. When love did not come seeking, she searched for it instead. Yes. And squeezing her arms to tie, she sadly crushed it dead. Uh. This one? Then squeezing her up so tight, she sadly crushed it dead. Okay. With vanity, a guiding star, or chilling ore, she sailed us on this one. With vanity, a guiding star, and then the window. She said, let's see with the light. Yes. Oh, we did it. Oh, let's go. That was a cool little sequence. Is it too late to change her fate? To give her something more? me hold my hand stay strong i won't let you drown act three the kid right months months later Months? How are you doing this morning? Not bad. A little stiff and sore, but nothing serious. 
I just dream so much. I wake up tired. Turn around, please. Was it the apartment dream again? Same as always? Yeah, same as the past few weeks. It looked like my apartment, but it felt like I was somewhere else entirely. Somewhere different. Uncomfortable. What's for breakfast? Was anyone else there? At breakfast? In the dream? Oh, no. I don't think so. The place was empty, but somehow felt alive. Like it didn't want me to leave. So, I'm here. In the middle of the apartment. That is so creepy. And it feels hostile. Which is weird because it's empty. It's hostile because somebody's looking through the window, Gloria. I know I don't belong here anymore and I want to escape. But the moment I decide to leave, the air becomes suffocating. I feel like I'm dying and I don't know why. And then just like that, something changes. Um, an idea. A new perspective. And it strikes me. What is this idea, Gloria? I don't understand. Hope. Even if I'm not where I want to be, even if I have nowhere to go, as long as I'm breathing, there is hope. And life feels tolerable again. That's very inspiring, Gloria. You can always count on me to help make your life good again. Don't even start with that, Bob, because you know damn well <laughs> if you let us go, we will be happy and our life would be truly good again. I'm not sure you can help with that, Bob, but thanks anyway. Oh, that went by a little bit too fast. <laughs> right. Okay. Anything else I can interact with? This milk makes my stomach churn. These branches look indestructible. They seem to be coming from somewhere deep within. I'm glad it's feeling like home. Anyway. That's not really the case, Bob. Yeah, sorry, I mean... Anyway, keep going. Right. Um. Let's leave before this thing rings again. Okay, let's leave. We can walk out. Right, okay. Goodbye, Granny. I hope your kettle keeps whistling, long and loud. Goodbye, Mr. Mysterious. I'm sure people would love to hear you conduct orchestras again, but that's up to you. I won't miss your mess, you two. And between us, darling, let him go. It'll be better for both of you. Bye. I won't miss your crying baby. <laughs> oh god. But I wish the both of but I wish the both of you all the best. That's funny. 
I mean, babies can get annoying after a while. Like, shout outs to moms, because that is a mess to deal with. And then what happens? You are so creepy, Bob. Nothing special. Took the elevator. Awesome. <laughs> That's all you have to say? Awesome? You yeah, have, right? Okay. Um. Oh. Um. Not that way. Right, okay, yeah, we we do not go that way. I take one last breath. One last step forward. And it's done. I'm free again. Wow. No wonder you're tired. Th that's all you have to say, Bob? I hope these strange dreams aren't bothering you too much. If so, we'll make arrangements. Like letting me go? That's the one thing I can't help you with, Gloria. I know, but I can't see the harm in asking every now and then. Can you think of anything else that might make you happy? How about some magazines? I miss hearing about the world. Do you think your boss would, would be okay with that? I... I will have to ask. What sounds good for breakfast? Scrambled eggs with toast and a lemon tea. Of course. How do you want your eggs? The usual, with sweet peppers and all that stuff. Very well. Right, the usual. Uh-huh, yeah, peppers and things like that. God. <laughs> if, if if I was in her situation, I, I'm sorry. I would have, I would have starved to death. <laughs> I would have starved. I can't. There's no way. There is no way you can keep me in a room like this for months. <laughs> no goddamn way. Need to remember to ask Bob for a new box of tampons. New York, New York. I could just stare for hours. So many details. Pretty and comfortable. Huh, not bad, Bob. Okay, well, Bob is making breakfast, gym time. Oh, gym time, you say? Oh, 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 okay, Gloria. Oh! Oh, we're working now. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Oh, we're working out. Uh, I'm struggling this morning. Yeah, because it's, this is harder than it looks. Come on. Oh my god. Almost there, Gloria. Almost there. Okay. Oh. go okay wait okay this is hard
This is so hard. You have no idea. Then it's getting smaller. Gloria. Oh, boy. Ah, Master Money. What do you want? I don't think it's good for you to have newspaper or magazines. Of course you don't. How about some of the classics instead? Proust, Flaubert, Chateaubriand? Kind of misses the point of keeping up with the outside world. The outside world, an overrated concept. Says the one who isn't trapped inside a cage. Now let me enjoy my day in peace. Right. Today. It wasn't a bad day. Too bad I can't have the damn magazines. Bob, never met a nicer loser. Harmless and obliging. The master. If he was planning to hurt me, He'd have done it by now. He's probably even more stuck up than his servant. Won't even see me face to won't even see me face to face. The pros of this life. No need to work anymore, or shave my legs, or do the dishes. And what Bob cooks? Three star Michelin quality easily. The cons. No parties to attend, no TV to watch. And I kind of miss the sun. The black swan. Aldo must have recu recruited a, a, a couple of girls. Younger, flexible, naive, I'm better off here. Joy. She probably thinks I disappeared because she dumped me. Egomaniac. Bet she's not losing a a any sleep over it. Freedom. Freedom is overrated. Luxury, tranquility, truffle, omelets. These are the values of today. What time is it? Day. Yes, go into a deep sleep. Bob, don't let Bob be the final thought that puts you to sleep, Gloria, please. Bob is the final thought that she thinks of to put her to sleep. <laughs> oh my god. What was that flash? What was what was that? Bob? Is that you? Right, okay, I think this is a good point to stop. <laughs> but, wow, okay. Um, it, it looks like we're just diving into a lot of just psychological topics. I feel like the majority of the section that we explored was probably a lot of her inner negative thoughts and probably just the subconscious things that she thinks of herself um, and her regrets and um you know like things like that so definitely some some dark thoughts there but i'm just wondering if she'll actually ever get out because this is crazy <laughs> i can't imagine being in a situation i really can this is insane but anyways we're about to find out what's going to happen um, in this next sequence in the next episode. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough today. Hope you have an awesome day and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.